How you guys doing today? This is Dane with Good, Bad, and Ugly. And today I'm going to show you how to pull the firing pin out of your XD model Springfield Ar Armory handgun. Or pistol, whatever you'd like. I've already gone ahead and torn, torn down the gun down to just the slide. If you want, if you're getting into this this far already, you already know how to take all this stuff apart. So, let's get started here. What we're going to need, we're going to need a couple sets of punches, brass or a nylon hammer. Helps out so you don't mar up the actual pistol in the slide. A block. I use wood because it's easy and I can beat the bejesus out of it and it doesn't damage anything. Alright, so with this roll pin that we have right on top here, this hole is tapered to the bottom. So you're actually going to need to pull pound that out from the inside to the outside. I like using my 1 8 punch. Makes it a little bit easier. Sorry, it's not a 1 8 It's 3 30 seconds. Sorry about that. I wasn't paying attention to what I was saying there. But, give it a nice couple hits. Some of them are pretty tight. There you go. There's my roll pin, and as you can see, it's starting to get pretty worn out. You can see what that tapered hole's doing to that thing. I don't know if we can get this thing to focus on it. Oh, you can kind of see it a little bit. Pull your punch out. Now we're going to go to the back here. Got to push this little plastic piece down below your backing plate. And slowly slide your backing plate forward until you get it about there. Now you're going to want to pull on it here, but you're going to want to put your thumb over this because you got a whole bunch of springs in there that like that are going to shoot all over the place. So we're going to put our thumb over it. Nope. There you go. There goes the backing plate. Put your hand over it so you don't lose the spring. Slowly let up. There you go. Here's that. Get your spring. got your actual firing pin right here and this is your cocking indicator so there you go now feel free if you're already at this point inspect all your equipment make sure everything's functioning properly there's also another little spring that's down in there it's kinda hard to get to what I like to do grab a punch feed it down in there real nice and pull it out this spring makes sure makes sure that your firing pin doesn't slam forward when you close the slide and shoot a round off. So, and then now putting it back together, you know, take your spring, let it slide down in there. If you need to, give it a couple taps. Make sure it doesn't it goes all the way, seeds all the way in there. Take your firing pin, line all that up. You want to make sure that this top piece slides right in there. What I like to do is I like to detent this, push my firing pin forward. Some spring springs are a little bit more under more tension and actually pushes this, keeps pushing this off that. But since this gun's been pretty beat, that thing is starting to loosen up a little bit. And then at that you have your roll pin hole there. It's perfectly in line with everything now. So you're gonna take your roll pin at this point you want to make sure, because you'll be able to see the taper in the actual roll pin. Put that piece in first. Ooh, I think I need a new roll pin. Give it a good couple taps to seat it in there properly. There you go. You want to make sure that's a little under flush there. Turn it back over, make sure that's not protruding on the back side either. Right there. There's that. Flip it up this way. Take the little plunger and your cocking indicator. Get that a little slightly centered. Take this spring, slide that over the top. This little plastic piece that holds your backing plate on. You have to line that up and the cocking indicator all up together. 
Take another punch. Press that down the rest of the way. So you can get your backing plate back on. Put the backing plate back in the grooves. We're back at where we were starting out. Press it forward. And there you go. That's a disassembly and a reassembly of taking your firing pin out of your XD model firearm. Thanks for watching, guys. If you guys want to see any more videos like this, please leave comments. If there's other things you would like to see, and again, leave a comment. This is Dane with Good, Bad, and Ugly. See you guys later.